me use the check so fast, man. Yeah, what are you saying just now? Yeah, how come you just complete your check so fast, bro? Why this is new trucks, buy Everything is same on this truck. There's no need for check anything. We got to be careful of the confirmation bias, right? We need to check for the no. There's critical checks on these trucks, even though they may be new equipment. Uh, the oil could be burned out over the past 12 hours. There's the coolant level that can be burned out over the past 12 hours. And you need to conduct those physical checks on the equipment. So don't base your um, confirmation on the information that you would have gotten from the night shift. Confirmation bias was a buy. Four years I'm driving this truck. You ever hear anything wrong with this truck? You ever see this truck break down? It's, it's maybe walking, brand new equipment. There is no need to check anything. Well, you see, you're basing your, your, your knowledge on the outcome bias, right? Based on, on previous outcome that nothing would have happened over the past four years. I want to advise you to utilize the GoArc platform by using the checklist and selecting the right equipment and not just by ticking the box but doing the physical checks on the equipment and ensuring that it's sent off and ensure that these checks are completed before going into the operation. Thank you. It looks the same as yesterday or I have been doing it this way for years and nothing has ever changed. When you make such statements, you are more than likely operating in a bias. Let us overcome the confirmation and outcome bias by searching for the no, cues to stop. Let us think about what can go wrong so we never have to ask what went wrong.